Bring him on back, bring him on back. The grand old Opry Kitty, well, Johnny and Jack. That old stage down at the Ryman, how the boards went clackety clack. Bring him on back, them old good times, bring him on back. Do you miss them Sunday dinner that your mama used to make? Do you miss that nanner pudding, the big old chocolate cake? When the preacher came for dinner, all those kids we had to wait. Bring them on back, them old good times, bring them on back. Bring them on back, bring them on back. The grand old Opry Kitty, well, Johnny and Jack. That old stage down at the Ryman, how the boards went clackety clack. Bring them on back, the old good times, bring them on back. Do you miss them summer hay rides holding hands with Linda Jones? Do you miss them watermelons you pick up on your way home? Do you miss the grand old Opry when them high and lonesome tones? Bring them on back, them old good times, bring them on back. Bring them on back, bring them on back. The grand old Opry, Kitty Wells, Johnny and Jack. That old stage down at the Ryman, how them boards would clackety clack. Bring them on back, them old good times, bring them on back. Bring them on back, bring them on back. The grand old Opry, Kitty, Wells, Johnny and Jack. That old stage down at the Ryman, how them boards move clackety clack. Bring them on back, them old good times, bring them on back. Okay, thank you a lot. Appreciate it. Bring them on back. Marshall, I'll try to sing some more of them songs that you wrote before we get off the stage. Do some more of them numbers. <clears throat> What's that? We can do that, too. Yes, sir. I'm going to do some guitar picking for you right now, though. Try to. And when I do this, when I play this tune, the other fellas always join in and takes a lot of it away from me. It won't let me have it all. <laughs> well, they'll do a fine job on it, I guarantee you. I've been calling this from Carter's Blues for a long time. Woo! You have to get out of tune to play this. Here we go.
Thank you. Two trees on a hillside of the mountain Always looking up toward the sky Reminds me of my papa and my mama Who lived there 80 years before they died Now a bright moon is shining in the valley An old wagon leans against a stack of hay Two graves on a hillside by a cabin My mom and dad are resting there today Burning up the green wood on the fireplace Falling snow around the red bud trees Branches up the fire by the creek bed And the ripping waters of the gentle stream Now a bright moon is shining in the valley An old wagon leans against a stack of hay Two graves on a hillside by a cabin my mom and dad are resting there today Papa used to talk about the young days When he and mama first were settled there he spoke about the love of the mountain That he and mama shared together there Now a bright moon is shining in the valley An old wagon leans against a stack of hay Two graves on a hillside by a cabin My mom and dad are resting there today An old wagon leans against a stack of hay Two graves on a hillside by a cabin My mom and dad are resting there today Thank you. Thank you kindly. Appreciate your hand applause. All right, we're going to move along. And uh, I was thinking of that song, uh, Bring Them On Back. Uh, the Grand Ole Opry, Kitty Wells, Johnny and Jack, that made me think about you folks can tune in to Grand Ole Opry Wednesday, uh, July, uh, July 3rd on Wednesday. The Wednesday Night Opry, I guess that's a new thing they have, will be on that night. And uh, a lot of other folks don't know a whole lot about it yet, but July 3rd in Nashville is the Grand Ole Opry on Wednesday night. The Wednesday Night Opry, July 3rd. Keep that in mind. Got a little Facebook, got a website, LarrySparks.com, and you can get there. We're open 24-7. We never close, and you can get with us anytime. We have a lot of Facebooks. I've got three Facebooks. I ain't never seen one of them yet. But I have a lady that takes care of all that. Her name is Phyllis Rice. She works with me now in promotion, and she works with me as a publicist, promoter, and booking shows for me. Phyllis is here today from the state of Kentucky, her and her husband, Jack, uh, Jack Rice, Phyllis Rice. Phyllis, I don't know where you're at, but we'll catch you later. And my wife, Pam, she's here somewhere too. I want to say hello to her. And I don't know where she's at. She got one of them green Larry Sparks shirts on. And uh, hey, I want to thank all the Larry Sparks shirt people, Roger Blake and uh, Betty and uh, Oral Cooper and Arlene and a whole bunch there. For them Larry Sparks shirts, you see them walking around. That's some of my good friends. We nothing we wouldn't do for one another, and I wouldn't do nothing. And that's the way it is. We go through life doing nothing for one another. But uh, <laughs> I don't, I don't. I'm only killing time. <laughs> All right. Well, we're having a good time here at Bean Blossom, as we always do, folks. I guarantee you that. 
I want to thank Mr. Dwight Delman and the folks for having us back this year. And they're fine folks and to work with Dwight and his family. And we're glad to be here at Bean Blossom once again. Let's see now. We want to uh, do a song that uh, someone asked me for the last suit. Last suit. Well, let's do that. <clears throat> okay, I can do all of them. start this off myself, okay? Why? That's a lot, a lot cheaper to do I it that figured, way. Huh? I figured. <laughs> Banker boys, plane went down just three miles south of town on a 40 acre farm he foreclosed on I can hear him Saying now, money is what it's all about. And I can safely say that he's dead wrong. The last suit you wear won't need no pockets. You can't take it with you when you go. When that handful of dirt goes back into the earth, what you be worth only heaven knows. You know he always said You gotta dress for success And he wore the very best That money could buy He made a fortune in his time Now he leaves it all behind They ought to write this on the stone there where he lies the last suit you wear won't need no pockets you can't take it with you when you go when that handful of dirt Goes back into the earth What you'll be worth Only heaven knows So I'll play a long song See, we got uh, we got a date coming up next week, Tyler. If you want to mention about our show date coming up the next uh, week, there Thursday, I believe it is. We'll be at the yeah. Summersville yeah. Festival up there, right. in Summersville, West Virginia. That's right. Yeah. Be, uh, yeah, are you from there? Well, we'll see you up there then. Big old Summersville Festival up there. <laughs> Jack is a big West Virginia too, and uh, got that big festival. Let me also mention that we'll be. <clears throat> In July, Larry said that we'll be up in uh, at the Grand Ole Opry on the 3rd. In July 4th, we'll be up in North Carolina at the Red, White, and Bluegrass Festival. And then we'll journey on Saturday to Conway, Missouri. So if any of y'all are up that way, then, then we'll see y'all down there. <laughs> Thank you, Tyler. I was standing by the bedside where my favorite mother lay When 
she called me close beside her And these words I heard her say I've just seen the rock of ages Jacob's ladder hanging down I've just crossed the river of Jordan Now my son I'm homeward bound All around her The tears began to fill our eyes And she called me close beside her Whispered softly her goodbye Pine breeze blowing on the mountain where forever she will lay There she'll rest beside the fountain There she'll sleep beneath the clay The rock of ages Jacob's ladder hanging down I've just crossed the river of Jordan Now my son, I'm homeward so much. I'm going to turn these fellas loose a little bit and we're going to all join in. Do this next tune a little picking for you. Tyler introduced this tune. You and Jack's been working on this a little bit and working practicing on it. Oh, we've been working hard on this tune, Larry. <laughs> this is a tune that Larry recorded on his Civil Reflections album, which we have just a few more up there. The Civil Reflections album is going out of print here. After all those are up there are gone, there'll be no more Civil Reflections, at least for a few years. But this is a tune that he did back in the 80s called Rich Men.
Thank you so much. Appreciate that. Mistakes and all. Thank you on my part. <laughs> I'll have to learn that tune again, Tyler. That's been a long time. That's yeah, going back several years, about 30, by the way, or so. But uh, I've missed a couple little spots. But uh, <laughs> All right. You all having a good time with us, we hope, here tonight. But just for having a good time, I'm going to sing you this song. It's called Tennessee 1949. I wonder if it's raining in the mountains I wonder how the old town looks today If the church is there beside the river Could I go back and find where mama lay Does life still go to sleep just after sunset Are the berries still that big on the vine do old men sit and talk about the old days The way they did in 1949 Oh, 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 how I'd like to be Back in the hills of Tennessee Oh, 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 it would be so fun If I could just go back to 1949 I wonder if by chance they might remember Teenage boys so wild and fancy free Who always loved guitars and country music If I went back would they remember me I wonder what became of Catherine Akers The girl who broke my heart at 17 I barely can remember what she looked like Thirty years ago she was my dream Oh, 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 how I'd like to be Back in the hills of Tennessee Oh, 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 it would be so fine If I could just go back to 1949 For many years I've searched the wide world over For what I don't recall I didn't find Now I'm searching pictures in my memory For Tennessee 1949 Oh, 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 how I'd like to be Back in the hills of Tennessee So fine if I could just go back to 1949. You all like that? What do you think, Mr. Larry Sparks? There. Let me mention back in the back, we have a white tent. And on, b below that white tent is a big old green scarf that says Larry Sparks. It's to the right of the shelter up there. And we have some merchandise back there. We have some Larry Sparks albums. We have the newest album, yeah. Almost Home. Well, they're CDs now, I guess. Almost Home, and we have some other albums from the 1970s and on through the decades. We also have some Larry Sparks pictures that we'd all be able to sign for you and love to. And also, some Larry Sparks Mapes guitar strings made by the Mapes Piano String Company. And uh, we have light, medium, and heavy, and, and we'd be glad to see you all up there. So stop by our, our tent back there. It's to the right of the pavilion. Big old white white tent back there. It says Larry Sparks. And uh, let me mention that in, in 1946, you know, bluegrass music started and with the Bill Monroe and the Bluegrass Boys. And, yeah. And since then... 
since then, there's, there's been a lot of people that's come through the music industry, a lot of people that's come through bluegrass music, but only a few have come to be what we would call legends. Only a few. And, and this guy up here, he's one of them. He's a legend. Give him a big hand. This year makes him 50 years in the music business. And during that time, he's traveled all across the country, all across the globe, traveled to countries like Japan and, and Canada and all over the place. When you hear Larry Sparks, when you hear one note of the, out of that guitar, you know, you know who's playing that guitar. When you hear one voice, one, one word from that voice, you know who's singing. He's a stylist. He's a legend. Make welcome in Bean Blossom tonight, the one and only Larry Sparks. A face in the crowd on your wedding day. You tossed me a rosebud from your bridal bouquet. No one seemed to notice. No one wondered why. When you pledged your love to him, there were tears in my eyes. The face in the crowd. With a pale yellow rose Your gown of white satin My half-worn out clothes I knew your love one time Your love now he holds I'm a face in the crowd with a pale yellow rose As your friends they all kissed you I heard someone say The man with the rosebud from your bridal bouquet Was he kind of special Or was he just a friend I heard you speak softly He was only a friend The face in the crowd With a pale yellow Your gown of white satin My half-worn out clothes I knew your love one time Your love now he holds I'm a face in the crowd With a pale yellow rose You kindly, you folks asked for that. I hope you liked it once again. I face in the crowd in uh, one of my old songs and been singing for a long time. Let's see now. We can do that for you, Kentucky girl. We got a, we got a lot of time left here to, before we have to get off the stage. We got a lot of songs to play for you and sing. Yeah. Well, I'm going to start this next song off on my Larry Sparks International Gold Guitar Strings. You might recognize this song. Hey, mama, 
Here's a letter from your son Well, I think my city days are done, Ma And it ain't been three weeks since I came Hey, Mama I do remember what you said Say your prayers before you go to bed, son And remember, city women ain't the same I'm like a John Deere tractor In a half-acre field Trying to plow a furrow Where the soil is made of steel Oh, I wish I was home home where the bluegrass is growing And the sweet country girls don't complain Mama so much perfume I thought I'd drown And the Lord didn't seem to be nowhere around Hey, I fell like a flower from the vine Oh, she was pretty, Lord knows Thought that she would bring me joy She laughed, she called me country boy ma And after she had been so kind I'm like a John Deere tractor In a half acre field Trying to plow a furrow Where the soil is made of steel Oh, I wish I was home all Where the bluegrass is growing And the firelight shimmers and shines I had to do that ending over because I was out of tune on the other one, so I just switched it up. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Got to tune it up a little bit. All right. Well, thank you so much. We're going to move along, and uh, I don't want to sing you folks a little bit of gospel music tonight. I haven't had a chance to sing none yet, and I know a lot of folks come out to hear the gospel songs, and we want to sing you a little bit of them here tonight before we get off the stage and make room for someone else uh, coming on after us. And uh, let's see now. We want to, uh, let, let's do the uh, song I had a, a lot of requests for today. Do we have this, uh, Tyler, you take care of the sales. You know what we have. You know every CD up there. Every one of them. <laughs> do we have the, uh, I just want to thank you, Lord, CD. We just got some more today. We just got some more today. See, I don't know anything about all that stuff. <laughs> But, okay, we got some more. I didn't know we did, but that's great. And, and we thank the company for sending them in to us. And this is a song I have a lot of requests for everywhere we go around the country. Recorded this uh, about 10, 12 years ago, I guess, and then 
After that, I, for some reason, I recorded it again. I don't know why. I'm trying to get it right, I guess. But this is on the album called I Just Want to Thank You, Lord, and that's the song that I want to sing for you. It goes like this. Just want to thank you, Lord, for every time you heard me pray. Just want to thank you for always being there. When I was so down and now, you came along. Made me want to shout Just want to thank you, Lord Thank you, Lord If I had a thousand lives to live I'd give them all to my Lord He's been so good to me that is the least I could afford. He's made good times outnumber the bad. He's been the best friend I ever had. Just want to thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I just want to thank you, Lord, for every time that you heard me when I prayed. And I want to thank you for always being there. I've been down and out, but you've always been right there beside me. And there's been times, Lord, you were the only friend only friend that I had. So I want to take a minute to thank you. Thank you, Lord. Just want to thank you, Lord, for every time you heard me pray. Just want to thank you for all Always being there when I was so down and out, you came along, made me want to shout. Just want to thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I just want to thank. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. And that's true for me, folks. I want to thank the Lord tonight for what he means to me. And I'm glad that I know Jesus Christ in my heart and in my life and in my soul tonight. And I, I'm the came acquainted with the Lord many years ago, and well, since I was a child, really, but uh, I came to know the Lord 100% a few years ago and accepted Jesus Christ into my heart, into my soul, into my life. I give him a, I take my music, and I, I put a little pinch of God here, and a pinch of Jesus Christ here, and a little pinch of this, a little pinch of that. God is wonderful. He is wonderful. He's a great God. And I have turned, I have turned everything over to him. It's in his hands. He's the creator of all. And I thank him tonight. I know who he is. When I'm still and I listen, 
He speaks to me when I be still and listen. God is wonderful. Jesus Christ is real, and he calls us all the time, you know, to come to him. And I'm so glad that I did one time and accept Jesus as my Savior and got in the Word, in the Word, in the Bible, in the Word of God, and, and start living a different life, seeing things different, talking different, thinking different. And you, and you're just a new creature. God will make us a new creature. And we don't go back to the old things and old ways. We don't want that. We done lost appetite for that. You see, we have to lose our appetite for many things that we used to do when we was the old man. But now we're the new man, new creature in God. And I thank him tonight for what he means to me. I love Jesus Christ. And me and my wife both, we have a little prayer meeting at our home once a month. And... Uh, we, we bring the Lord in our house and, and try to keep him there and in our, his spirit in our, in our home. And it makes a difference, you know, when you, when you do that in your home. And let him, he will not dwell. He will not dwell where he is not welcome. God will not dwell. And I, I want to tell you that uh, next month, the well, last week of July, you might have some flyers on this, our all-gospel festival that we put together here, Dwight, Dillman, myself, and Nathan, and all of us, Nathan Stanley, and a bunch of us, got a gospel festival, uh, I think two days, here, the last week of July. And I want you to come and be with us. You'll enjoy yourself. And my, my preacher, uh, pastor, will be here, uh, Daryl Peters. He will be here preaching, praying, and singing. For He'll do like a whole thing here on the stage for 30 minutes, uh, 40 minutes on stage so each day. And I want you to hear him. I really do. He don't need a microphone either. He don't. <laughs> but I, I really want you to hear him. But he's a great man and a good man of God. And he lives what he says. He lives it every day. And, and that's in this day and time, there's many things will come against us, you know, in, in life. And, and, and without God in our lives, why well, the old devil can move in. You know what I'm saying, folks? All right. What do you say? Two more. Two more. All right. Two more. Okay. Well, I hope I made some sense to you, what little bit I, I, I said. And did I, have I made any sense? Did I say anything? All right. Two more songs, and this will, I guess, end us up, and uh, someone else will be coming out on the stage. Just like a ship I set out to sea with no one to guide me along. Drifting along without direction as the waves grew fearful and strong. I wanted to show the world I could conquer the waves of life on my own. Soon found out just couldn't do it. I'd never make it alone. My ship it wrecked in the midst of the ocean. Couldn't swim back to shore burned and battered by the storms of life till it couldn't take anymore I cried master please rescue me from drowning in the sea I need you to guide me from the storms hide me from all these troubles set free there's a rescue ship from the King's Harbor shore Better get on board today It's the greatest ship that's ever sailed The ship's the only way To rescue you from your storm-tossed life When you just can't take any more Jesus is the captain on the rescue ship that sails from the King's Harbor shore.
Then into my view I saw a great ship sailing on the dark waves. It looked steady and so strong as it quickly came my way. With the searchlight shining so powerful and bright, found me there just in time. Knew it was sent from the King's Harbor shore, poor lost sailor to find. There's a rescue ship from the King's Harbor shore, better get on board today. It's the greatest ship that's ever sailed. This ship's the only way to rescue you from your storm-tossed life when you just can't take any more. Jesus is the captain on the rescue ship that sails from the King's Harbor shore. Thank you so much. That's a request for that number today, the ship from King's Harbor Shore. What a good message. Got time for one more number, and this will wind us up. And uh, it was really great to be with you this year at Bean Blossom, and we coming back in July of the All Gospel Festival, September with the Bluegrass Festival. We'll be back in that too. Uh, and it was really great to sing with Ralph today, Ralph Stanley on his show. Well, I, it was a pleasure and an honor to sing with him. And, and I was glad to get a chance to do that again. Jack Kincaid, what do you got to say? Hey, this place up here is always awesome to play. You all are, must be the greatest fans of all time. The great up people here, here. Up here at the Bing Blossom, Indiana. Sure are the Proud to be here. Thank you all for coming folks. out and support what we do. Thank you. All right, how about you, Tyler? Yeah, it's always great to be here at Bean Blossom. I'd like to say a special howdy to my mom and, and dad and Mike over there and friends Tom and Ann Sparks. And also my good friend, Kearney Wilson, over there, way over there in the dark, Larry. And uh, thank you all for coming out, and we all sure appreciate you all. Yeah, I want to say uh, thanks to my wife, Dina. She come in today. She, she don't get to go to very many shows. She works, just works her butt off, you know. And my son, Johnny, he's running around here taking pictures and having a big time. Talking to everybody. He's a photographer. So I'm glad they got to come today. He's a photographer. He's a photographer. How come your mic's louder than mine? Because I'm talking right up on it. That's Tyler, man. He didn't ruin us all. I'm yeah, talking right up on it. Okay. All right. Thank you, folks. Again, we've enjoyed it. Hope you've enjoyed our show tonight. One more song. This is one that me and Ralph sang together many years ago, and I recorded it again myself in, uh, on an album I have called What Kind of Man. Thank you all so much. God bless you. Good night to you. Oh, he walked the sea of Galilee. You tell me what kind of man Jesus is. Oh, he walked the sea of Galilee. Tell me what kind of man Jesus is. What kind of man? What kind of man? Tell me what kind of man Jesus is. What kind of man? What kind of man? Tell me what kind of man Jesus is. Boy, oh, heal the sick, raise the dead. Tell me what kind of man Jesus is. Boy, oh, heal the sick, raise the dead. Tell me what kind of man Jesus is. What kind of man? What kind of man? Tell me what kind of man Jesus is. What kind of man? What kind of man? Tell me what kind of man Jesus is. May the lame to walk, 
Glad to see you. Tell me what kind of man Jesus is. Made the lame to walk. Glad to see you. Tell me what kind of man Jesus is. What kind of man? What kind of man? Tell me what kind of man Jesus is. What kind of man? What kind of man? Tell me what kind of man Jesus is. Some ramblers celebrating 50 years in the business. 50 years. Hey, what do you think? Larry? Yeah. music. He started with the Stanley Brothers when he was 16 years old. He was IBMA two-time male vocalist of the year in 2004-2005. His 40th anniversary album won a bent and album of the year. September the 24th in 2004, he was inducted into the Bill Monroe Bluegrass Hall of Fame. He's also been inducted into the George D. Hay Hall of Fame. Put your hands together here at Bean Blossom for Mr. Larry Sparks. Blue, stay away from me. Blues, why don't you let me be? Don't know why. meant for me True love was never meant for me Seems somehow we never can agree Blue Stay away from me Blues Why don't you let me be Don't know why you keep haunting me Tyler, huh? Right there, boy. Life is full of misery. Dreams are like a memory. Bring it back. Your love that used to be. Blue, stay away from me.
Right, thank you, Bean Blossom. The legendary Larry Sparks and the Lonesome Ramblers. Hey, it's Saturday night. You ain't gonna let him leave like that, are you? Larry. Larry, come up here just a moment, please, sir. Phyllis. No, we ain't going to hurt you, son. <laughs> okay, Larry, I know you thought you were done. But you're not quite yet. We've got one more thing we need to do here. And in honor of your 50 years, celebrating 50 years in bluegrass music, your wife, your son, your close family, Dwight Dillman, <laughs> Bean Blossom, your friends, I know it's a great place. First time, my first time at this festival, and I love it. It's it's wonderful. But we've got something we want to present you with, Larry. I need you to walk down the steps with me. Oh Lord. <laughs> okay, his wife says he can walk over here. Take him to the stage, Sam. Pam is going to take him to the side of the stage here. Go get him a new car. <laughs> There's a big old Thunderbird out there. Larry. Hey, Larry. Larry. I think Larry is very, very surprised over this. And uh, deservingly, he needs another encore, I'll guarantee you that. But uh, right now, he's got a car to drive. He's going to be driving it to his table, and I know he'd like to have a word or two with you all. Sam, uh, can you hear me okay? All right. Uh, yeah, this was a complete surprise to me. I, I, my wife knows what I, how I feel about old cars and stuff. And I, I, I don't know what to say. This is my favorite T-Bird, <laughs> and, and it's a favorite color, and I didn't know this was going to happen. But uh, thank you, honey, Pam, and who all was involved, I'm not sure, doing this for my 50 years. I want to have another 50 years. Yeah. <laughs> but you know, it, it, uh, family and friends and fans like you folks out there, just like every one of you, has helped make it all possible for people like me and people that are in this business that have done something. It's, you are a part of it, and you are our family. I want you to know that. You are our family, and we thank you so much. God bless you. We love you. Thank you. Thank you, Sam. Happy Father's Day, everybody. <laughs> the legendary Larry Sparks will be driving that Thunderbird up through the roadway, so be sure to keep it clear so Larry can get up.